I'm Bill Sacha from the St. Catherine Standard and I'm here in Niagara on the Lake at the Divergent Diamond Overpass over the QEW. It's, a, it's the first of its kind in Ontario. It's an idea that's supposed to save congestion and, and also make it safer for people as they're turning on and off the highway. Uh, time will tell if that will work. But. So we're about to embark on this little journey through the Diver Divergent Diamond Interchange and we'll, we'll see how it goes. I mean, when the project was, in the pro when the project was first announced in a couple of years ago at, at a public works meeting, it certainly got everyone's attention. The, the diagrams and the and the, the maps and, and the video clips of, of how it works. Got a green light here, and you know when you're looking up ahead with all the co-markers and the and the, the construction uh, barriers and things, I think it, it's a little more confusing than it will be once it's done, um, because you'll be able to get onto these the, the off ramps and the on ramps to the QBW Niagara bound and Toronto bound are uh, aren't finished yet, so they're still working on it. Um, seems fairly simple if you just kind of follow your lane through. Um, I guess where it gets sometimes where it gets a little daunting is that, that look ahead where it seems to be snaking back and forth and until you've been through it once or twice you don't quite understand where you're going. I know why it's causing some hesitation with drivers uh, but uh, the concept seems like it would be a good one. Uh, and you're, you're trying to eliminate those left-hand turns across traffic so that you can uh, make your on ramp and, and get off the, the QEW uh, safely and, and, and easily. Uh, I, I've heard complaints about you know how it would be for pedestrians, but the, all of the reports say that it's supposed to be good for pedestrians as well. Uh, and we're coming to the end of it now, uh, and that wasn't too much of a problem. Uh, and uh, it's a new concept; it'll take people a little get used to. But after once you travel it a few times, I don't think it'll bother you much. Uh, it seems pretty straightforward.